I want to tell you about this amazing conference happening here in Birmingham. It's the Life of the Prophet Muhammad conference. Have you heard about it? There's amazing speakers and Nasheed artists and Qaris who are going to be on the lineup. Assalamu alaikum, my name is Shreen Mahmood and I'm here in Birmingham. I'm so excited to be speaking to you about the Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him, conference that's coming right here in Birmingham on the 30th of September. Have you heard about it? Yes, I have, mashallah. I've seen some things about this on social media and Instagram, so yeah, it's really, really good to see. I think it's a really good opportunity for um, young youth to know more about Prophet Muhammad and his life. I have read about and seen something that's a great work by the Islam TV channel. What's your favorite quality about Prophet Muhammad, peace be upon him? Everything. There are so many qualities. There are many qualities of Rasulullah I couldn't choose. I can choose. My favourite thing about the most wonderful person that has ever existed is that he was the most amazing being that our Allah SWT has ever created and he has helped guide many Muslims as we follow the Sunnah of the Prophet. But my favourite quality in today's day and age is the akhlaq of Rasulullah because in today's day and age uh, there's no one who we can find who has morals as the way Rasulullah has. Uh, Books and pens can be broken out, but the thing is, the most which is I am considering on the time and running age is the khlaq. The Holy Prophet's khlaq has died needed in the time, in the Ummah and uh, community or society as well. Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam is just an inspiration overall. So everything about Prophet is just, is my favorite. Everything. I, I have two children, so everything I tell my children is related to what Prophet Muhammad used to do, what would Prophet do in certain circumstances, what would Prophet do. So Prophet is uh, a perfect man who's a perfect man who's, who's come on earth. So there's, there's nothing, there's not one particular thing I can say um, I actually really admire. I admire everything about Prophet. Just an overall character is a, is a true thing for the whole of mankind. He's, he's the best thing that's ever happened to this world. If you were to ever meet the Prophet, peace be upon him, what would you say to him? It is an amazing thing to meet you. I can't think of anything else on the top of my head right now. It's a very deep question. Um, I think I'd just be speechless. I don't think I'll be able to say anything. I feel like you wouldn't know what to say. I see there's so many things you could say. Probably end up crying to be honest. I feel like I have to work to be able to see Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. I mean, people see him in their dreams and that's like a sign of their righteousness. So if we're not righteous, then does, it doesn't really matter. We, we can't say anything to him because he probably won't look at us. Yeah. yeah, I think I just want to just listen to like any story he says. I feel like, because he was just a very great man. You just want to listen to everything he says and you just want, like, want to spend hours just listening to him. You wouldn't get bored, I feel like, as well. The personality of our Prophet is the role model for a Muslim Ummah and me as well. So it's a very much important for us. And how important is it to have events like this in the community? I think, I think in this day and age, it is very important, especially for the youth as well, as it's like an eye-opener, because everyone, everyone has their tests and trials, and they need the eye-openers. I've had my fair share as well. So to host events like this and to hold events like this is, is amazing for the youth of today, I believe. Knowing that as a Muslim Ummah we follow somebody that basically guides us in Islam and the Sunnah that we follow and it's an amazing thing to be able to follow someone who we all look up to, Alhamdulillah. Anything in particular you're looking forward to about this event? The stalls that should be in the ICC, I've been told there's over 100 stalls and there's a conference that's taking place. So it'll be really good to hear from certain Imams and Sheikhs who'll be able to talk about the Prophet Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam. Uh, definitely, it's be attending. Mm -hmm.